Hi, it's Ian Hull, and welcome to Two Minutes with Hull and Hull. Today, I want to follow up on my last podcast, and I would describe it as finishing the thought. And my thought is, how do I consider the question of trusts and trust law in the perspective of my estate planning? talked a little bit last week about spousal trusts. We talked about discretionary trusts. This week, I want to talk a little bit about what are essentially uh, family trusts. And a family trust is a situation where the asset, maybe it's shares in a company or it's a stock portfolio that is put into a trust, and that is held by the trustees. And the trustees are obligated to distribute amongst a fixed group, and it's typically the family. So the children, the wives, if there's a first wife or a second wife, uh, uh, the we call them, obviously we'll define it more broadly as the spouses. So the children and spouses, if there are more than one, uh, in the sense of uh, having passed over uh, a lifetime. And of course, the whole opportunity to pass on your wealth to grandchildren and great-grandchildren. So the family trust is established with and typically if you're going to wanting to hold on to it for many generations you may need a significant amount of wealth to make it worthwhile any of the trusts that i've talked about administratively have additional costs it's like running a corporation every year you have to do annual filings every year you have to keep minutes those kinds of things and they're a little slightly different than corporate uh, uh, governance rules, but the same idea, and that is, is that you have to keep a record of the activity of the trust. So just to simply set up a trust is not always uh, good enough, and you want to make sure that you've kept up the trust with the proper infrastructure behind it, the proper tax filings behind it, and the proper administration steps behind it. But having said that, the idea of putting a trust into your estate planning is a good idea for some people and something that should be considered from time to time. And I often will run the concept by my clients when they come to see me when they're considering their estate planning in the right circumstances. So thanks so much for watching Two Minutes with Hull and Hull.